Four soldiers were killed and 58 wounded in a Hezbollah drone strike on an army base in Wadi Ara in the largest mass casualty event since the start of the war. Seven soldiers are in serious condition after the UAV crashed into a dining hall in a Golani Brigade training base as soldiers were eating dinner. The army is investigating how the projectile breached Israeli airspace without detection. An initial probe indicates that two drones launched by Hezbollah entered Israeli airspace from the sea. Both were Misrad suicide drones and its use was not unique. The UAVs were tracked by Israeli radar and one was shot down off the coast north of Haifa. Sirens sounded nearby but not at the base. Planes and helicopters chased the second UAV but it dropped off radar and was assumed to have crashed. The war in Lebanon is ongoing with the IDF advancing along the border in South Lebanon. The Air Force pounded 70 Hezbollah sites hitting rockets, rocket launchers and military buildings. Ground forces eliminated more than 100 terrorists in clashes in villages on the Lebanese side of the border. The army says that Hezbollah is attempting to use UNIFIL as a shield, firing rockets at Israel from near posts manned by UN forces. The IDF also released video of a Hezbollah fighter surrendering to IDF forces after exiting from a terror tunnel. The U.S. has confirmed that it's sending a THAAD missile defense system to Israel along with a crew of some 100 U.S. personnel to operate it. The decision came following the recent Iranian attack targeting Israel with 180 ballistic missiles. The Pentagon says the deployment will help counter potential Iranian reaction to an expected Israeli reprisal attack on Iran. Defense Secretary Austin authorized the deployment at the direction of President Biden. The thermal activated system is a complementary system to the Patriot air defense but can defend a wider area. Each battery includes six truck-mounted launchers and requires 95 soldiers to operate. A U.S. statement said the action underscores the ironclad U.S. commitment to the defense of Israel from any further Iranian attacks. Experience the power of truth with ILTV News. If you're looking for quality content and captivating visuals, join our news community and become an integral part of our team as we embark on a mission to unveil the real Israel, dismantling the web of lies and misinformation that surround reporting on Israel. By subscribing to ILTV News, you will not only have access to the latest updates, but you will also amplify our message, creating a ripple effect that carries the truth far and wide. Subscribe today and help reshape the narrative. Available on the web, Android, and Apple.